So, back in July 2025, astronomers made headlines by confirming comet 3I Atlas, the third interstellar object ever detected. Since then, new observations have revealed it's not just another visitor. It's far larger and heavier than its predecessors, instantly sparking heated debates across the scientific community. The journey of 3I Atlas into our awareness began on July 1, 2025, when Chile's Atlas Telescope spotted a strange, fast-moving object. Follow-up tracking revealed it was on a hyperbolic trajectory, a path that doesn't orbit the Sun. In other words, it came from deep space, far beyond our solar system. This made it the third interstellar traveler on record, joining the mysterious Oumuamua and comet Borisov. Each of these cosmic wanderers looks and behaves differently, highlighting just how little we understand about interstellar objects. Initial estimates placed 3I Atlas's nucleus at roughly 5.6 kilometers across, already larger than Borisov. But the real shocker wasn't just its size, it was how the comet moved. Comets are far from passive. As sunlight warms their surfaces, frozen gases vaporize, shooting off jets that act like tiny thrusters, nudging the nucleus in unpredictable ways. This non-gravitational acceleration is what made Oumuamua's motion so controversial. And now, 3I Atlas is showing its own set of puzzling behaviors. In the case of Borisov, the comet's motion behaved just as expected. Astronomers tracked its orbit using data from 227 observatories around the globe between May and September 2025. Even with clear signs of gas and dust being released, Borisov's path barely wavered. The non-gravitational deviation measured less than 15 meters per day squared, tiny, considering all the outgassing taking place. This surprising stability hinted at one thing. Borisov's nucleus was exceptionally massive. By balancing the force of the venting gases with the measured acceleration, researchers calculated its mass to be at least 33 billion tons. To put that in perspective, Borisov was much smaller, and Oumuamua weighed only a fraction of this. While 3I Atlas isn't as enormous as Bernardinelli Bernstein, it is extraordinary for an interstellar comet, challenging long-held assumptions about these cosmic wanderers. Astronomers call it an anomaly, not because it's unnatural, but because it defies predictions. Current models suggest that interstellar space should be filled mostly with tiny fragments left over from the formation of other planetary systems. These small bodies should vastly outnumber any giant ones. If that were true, our first interstellar detections should have been minor pieces, not kilometer-scale behemoths like 3I Atlas. So far, every interstellar object we've spotted has been surprisingly large, and 3I Atlas takes the crown. Stretching over five kilometers across, it's by far the heaviest interstellar visitor yet. The odds of detecting such a massive object this early, while countless smaller ones remain unseen, are staggeringly low. And that's exactly what makes it so puzzling. Size isn't the only thing that sets 3I Atlas apart. Observations from the James Webb Space Telescope reveal unusually high amounts of carbon dioxide relative to water, ranking it among the most CO2-rich comets ever studied. Ultraviolet data also shows it venting water vapor even at vast distances from the sun. Light polarization studies, which track how sunlight scatters off dust, uncovered patterns unlike anything seen in typical comets or asteroids. This hints at unique dust grain structures, potentially reflecting the exotic conditions where it was born. Early reports even suggest the presence of nickel without iron, an odd combination since these elements usually appear together in natural processes. Whether these anomalies are real or just observational quirks remains uncertain. But taken together, 3I Atlas is not only massive, it's chemically unusual, fueling debate and speculation. 
Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb notes that if these mass and composition traits hold up, natural explanations might fall short. NASA's Tom Statler emphasizes that it still behaves like a comet, but its anomalies raise big questions. As 3I Atlas nears the Sun, astronomers have a rare opportunity to see how such a massive interstellar comet responds to increasing solar activity. A key moment may have already occurred. In late September 2025, space weather forecasts predicted that a coronal mass ejection from the Sun could collide with the comet. If that collision happened, scientists might witness disturbances in its tail, much like Comet Enki experienced in 2007, when a CME tore off its ion tail. While the effects would likely be temporary, capturing this event would be unprecedented, as no interstellar comet has ever been observed in a direct solar storm interaction. Looking forward, the Herise camera on the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter is scheduled to attempt high-resolution imaging on October 3, 2025. Shortly afterward, 3I Atlas will pass into solar conjunction, disappearing behind the Sun from Earth's view. It won't reappear until December, when astronomers will get another chance to study its coma and tail at peak activity. Long-term monitoring will be essential to fully understand its behavior. The arrival of the Vera C. Rubin Observatory is also poised to revolutionize the field. In its first hours of operation, it cataloged thousands of new asteroids, and over years of continuous sky surveys, it is expected to uncover many more interstellar objects, potentially transforming our understanding of the galaxy's hidden travelers. With more interstellar objects detected, astronomers will finally be able to tell whether 3I Atlas is a true outlier or part of a hidden population of massive interstellar bodies. The stakes are high if large objects like this are common. It could rewrite our theories of planet formation and ejection in other star systems, hinting that massive comets are hurled into interstellar space more efficiently than we thought. If, on the other hand, such giants are rare, spotting 3I Atlas so early might reveal an observational bias or expose gaps in our understanding of how interstellar debris spreads across the galaxy. One thing is certain, 3I Atlas won't return, making this our only chance to study it up close and learn how interstellar comets form, evolve, and behave. It's only the third confirmed interstellar visitor ever recorded. Massive, mysterious, and impossible to ignore, so 3I Atlas is drawing eyes across the astronomical world. As it nears the sun, scientists will be watching every move, and so should we.